Hi friends! The EO month function in Microsoft Excel is used to calculate the last day of the month, which is a specified number of months before or after an initial supplied start date. Do you want to know how you can use the EO month function in Microsoft Excel? Let's go ahead and see how you can do so. Open the desired Excel worksheet. Select the cell where you want to get the function's result. Type equals EO month open parentheses, select the cell that contains the desired date, comma, type the number of months you want to add, close parentheses. Press enter and you'll get the result in date format. If it's not, then format the cell in date format. It will show the last day of the month, that is a specified number of months after an initial supplied start date. You can also subtract the number of months from any date. To do so, type equals EO month, open parentheses, select the cell that contains the desired date, comma, type minus, and then the number of months you want to subtract. Close parentheses. Press enter and you'll get the result in date format. If it's not in date format, then format the cell in date format. It will show the last day of the month. That is a specified number of months before an initial supplied start date. See? That wasn't hard at all. Thanks for watching. For more details, click on the i icon on the top right of the video. Check out our iYogi channel for self-help videos on Windows, Mac, smartphones, security, social media, and much more. Have something to ask or share? Pen it down in the comments. To get iYogi tech support, dial toll-free numbers. To stay empowered technically, subscribe to our channel.